Hello everyone. I hope you all are fine. Today we are going to study English. Before starting today's topic, I would like to share a short story. Yes, a story of a girl whose name is Mary. Mary is living with her mother, father, and her little brother Tom. Yes, and she has her favorite dog whose name is Dolly. Mary loves Dolly so much. She sits with Dolly, she eats with Dolly, she talks to Dolly, and even she plays with her doll, Dolly. One day, Mary went to the market with her mother and made a bed for Dolly and asked her to sleep there. But when she returned from the market, Mary was shocked as Dolly was not there. She was looking for Dolly here and there, but Dolly was not there. Then she noticed something under her bed. Oh, it was Dolly with her broken hand. Oh, Mary started crying and ran towards her father. Her father wiped her tears and asked her to calm down, Mary, calm down. Then he take out a glue and paste the dolly's hand. So, here I introduce today's topic. Any guesses? What is today's topic? No, no, it's not glue. It's joining words. Yes, like Mary's father joins dolly's hand with glue. In the same way, joining words help us to join words. Joining words are also known as consumptions. Consumptions are the words which help us to connect, to join words, group of words and sentences. We are going to learn about consumptions one by one with their usage. So a first consumption is and. And is also known as a pairing word. Why? Because it helps us to make pairs like lock and key. Yes, lock and key is used to close the door when you are out. Mom uses it. Right. And another example is pencil and paper. Then in breakfast you love to eat bread and butter. And is also used to join or connect words and sentences with the similar ideas. The word similar means same. For example, our first sentence is Ram loves to eat banana. And our second sentence is Ram loves to eat mango. So do you find any similarities between these two sentences? Any guesses? Yes! That banana and mango, these two fruits are loved by Ram. So because we find similarity in these two sentences, so we can rewrite this sentence. Ram loves to eat Banana and mango. Right? Let's take one more example. I have a pen and I have a paper. So how can I say? I can also say that I have a pen and paper. Let's do some exercise. Everyone take out your grammar book. Yes, fast. Now... Open page number 67, that is 67. Everyone, do it fast. Have you all opened? Yes, today we are going to do the exercise. Let's link it. In this exercise, you have to join the given sentences with the consumption and. We are going to learn the sentences one by one and rewrite them. Okay? So, should we begin? Yes. So, our first sentence is Rami has a tricycle. And second part of this sentence is Rami has a dog. 
So what is similarity in both the sentences? Yes, I know you must guess it. Doll and tricycle both Rani has. So we can rewrite the sentence in the way with using the conjunction and that Rani has a tricycle and a doll. Let's come to the second question. The first part of second question is we must keep our shoes clean. And second part of the sentence is we must keep our socks clean. So we can join the sentence with the conjunction and how? We must keep our shoes and socks clean. In the same way we will do the third sentence. The first part of the third sentence is I have pens and second part is I have pencils with me. So I can write it I have pens and pencils with me. Get it? I hope you have done question number 1, question number 2 and question number 3 in your book. Now move to question number 4. So what is the first part of question number 4? You can read it by yourself. Okay, I will help you in reading. My shirt is new. And second part of the sentence is My trousers are new. So I will join it with the conjunction and how my shirt and trousers are new. I hope you understand the topic well. Thank you.